Hello guys, Mukas here. What's up? So today I wanted to showcase quickly how to set up a router because this can be very useful in squad plays. It's a construction item that you can build very easily. It costs 500 search to unlock, so it's not very expensive and you can make a big difference with it. So here I, I was harvesting corsium. I found a big, uh, big clump and I filled up my ant. See if this one is locked. So I could bolt my silo, but actually I found uh, one silo that was open. So I just uh, use this guy's silo, sometimes you can use uh, other people's silo. Just don't take all their corsium, uh, don't be annoying of course. So with his silo I could build first my routing spar. I'm gonna build also an air terminal, this is extremely useful. Because uh, you, you, pull the, you pull the vehicles with the corsium, not with the nanites. So you can almost pull them for free. Here I was with the... With some of my NCIV fellows teaching them how to to set this up. Uh, very few people uh, know know how to set uh, construction items actually in the game. I noticed that um, not many people uh, use it, but it is uh, changing slowly with the last serious video. Honestly, he has motivating you has motivated me to to keep building. Here I'm building the Elysian spawn tube, and I'm gonna unload all Mark Corsium in this silo since it's unlocked. I c we can use it. We're gonna use this one instead of building a new one. So you can have a base yeah, ready, ready to, to roll pretty, pretty fast. Honestly, my my favorite items is the air terminals. So freaking useful. My favorite construction items, the the light air terminal, the vehicle terminal. This one that I'm placing right now. This is extremely useful. You can pull tanks. You can pull flashes, harassers with the corsium. Going up. I also recently unlocked the orbital strike, but I haven't tried it, it yet. Can you pull Valkyrie? And here I didn't know you could uh, bind to actually. your Elysian spawn tube, so I was placing a beacon to, to change class. But actually this wasn't necessary. Very guys, I'm gonna pull Valkyrie with the, with the router and we're gonna set up a spawn at uh, Ezatec. Now that I know that uh, you can bound to, uh, to an Elysian spawn tube, you just have to go close to it and press E, like you were using uh, uh, an object. So you go to your uh, Elysian spawn tube and press E. So here I'm going to take my router, so now we, that I've picked it up. Uh, I have it in my inventory, okay. like another another object. Spawn the Valkyrie, guys. And if I die, I'll lose it. That's why I, I'm, I'm yeah. pulling a Valkyrie, so then I can go place it somewhere. I cannot stop, guys. Here I asked my squad members to spawn on my Valkyrie, go to, to redeploy on it. And we're going to go place right this router at Azatec plant. So that's it, guys. This is not very complicated. Ready, guys, you harvest Corsium, you place a silo, you build your router, that's an air terminal if you need. And that's it. Make sure the router is in range of the silo so it's powered. If the silo runs out of Corsium, your construction that's items are going to start right there, decaying. The They're going to lose health over time. And you'll have to repair them. Or refill the silo. Like and that's it, the router is almost placed at Aza. You can place it almost anywhere. I found that uh, at the back of the balcony, it's one of the most useful spots. Okay, it's up. Router is it's building. It's uh, harder to reach for the people Coming attacking up. from the spawn, but it's actually quite vulnerable from the people flanking you from the back balcony. Let's cap a point. I'm gonna call for help. I'm gonna call for help in the orders. You can see this in the chat. If you tap uh, slash orders, you can talk to your entire faction, but you can send the message like that only only every two or three minutes. It can be useful if uh, people pay attention and if you give an opportunity of your, uh, for your faction to spawn, maybe they can join you. An infiltrator to hack the terminals. And we're, we're gonna have a very cool moment attacking uh, Azatec plant with a pretty small squad. Push the enemies guys, spawn camp the, camp the doors. I like the router because your whole faction can spawn on it. They don't need to be in your squad, but they have to be within 100 meters of the router to be able to use it. So they cannot use it across the map. They have to die or redeploy close to it. That was how to use a router in Planet Side 2. A point. So that's it guys. I'm gonna let the video continue with this cool moment. Try to have your routing spy ready. It's gonna be useful in squad plays. Have a good day. Stay epic. Bye bye guys. Nice hold. I'm down. Oh, stop shooting. And Charter, yes!
Hallo. Let's go, Frank. Double killer. Trying to hold this. Nice hold. Chip on. Never know what Damn it. 